The Ichimoku cloud helps us to find the support, resistance, as well as momentum, trend direction, and also the past performance of the price, all in one indicator. It is a powerful indicator, which contains a collection of other technical indicators, similar to moving averages. Ichimoku contains three indicators and five lines. The main one is the cloud indicator with two lines, then there is a two moving average, and the third one is a lagging indicator. Let me explain the Ichimoku cloud, which is very simple. Choose the Ichimoku indicator first. I'm changing the Chico span color to blue. The names are in Japanese, because this indicator is found by Japanese. First let's see about the moving average. It consists of two lines, the Tenkan Sen, and the Kijin Sen, also called as conversion line, and base line. The conversion line act as a minor support and resistance. It is calculated by the sum of highest high, and the lowest low divided by 2, over the previous 9 time period. The baseline is also same, but it takes the past 26 time periods into account. The crossover of these lines indicates the change in the trend or the continuation of the trend. The cloud indicator is also called as Kumo cloud. It is formed by two lines, span A, and span B. If span A is above span B, then the cloud will be yellow color, and if span B is above span A, then the cloud will be in blue color. Both clouds act as a major support and resistance. Lagging indicator is also called as Chico. It is used for the confirmation of the trend. Now let's see how to read Ichimoku indicator. If the conversion line crosses the baseline upwards, then it indicates the uptrend, and if the lagging span is above the current price, it confirms the uptrend. If the conversion line crosses the baseline downwards, then it indicates the downtrend, and if the lagging span is below the price, then it confirms the downtrend. If the lagging span passes near the price, or through the price, then it indicates the trading range. The Kumo cloud helps us to find the dynamic support and resistance, with the help of price action. Wider the cloud, stronger the support and resistance. If the cloud is weak, support and resistance are weak. If the price is above the Kumo for longer period, then it is a strong uptrend. And if the price is below the Kumo for long period, then it is a strong downtrend. Don't try to take a trade inside the Kumo cloud. Never. RSI is a perfect indicator to use with Ichimoku indicator. Just trade with the trend for best results. Comment your thoughts about this indicator.